According to the Center for Disease Control and Prevention, peak flu season typically falls between December and February. Local 3's Corinne Griffith joins us with tips on how to keep yourself healthy. Corinne? While peak flu season typically ends in February, it is possible to get the flu as late as May. It's important to protect not only yourself, but those around you from the influenza virus. Influenza is a respiratory virus. It infects your, your nose, your throat, and your chest. It, resolves in, it results in a lot of nasal congestion, a sore throat, coughing, and often um, accompanies with like a high fever and body aches. But there are ways to help prevent the flu. Washing your hands thoroughly throughout the day and minimizing touching your face, mouth, and eyes. Cover your mouth when you cough or sneeze. Try to stay away from sick people and of course get vaccinated. The number one way to prevent influenza is to get vaccinated. This year we've already had some mild to moderate flu activity here in Marquette. Some of the most predominant strands, the H1N1 strand, is included in this year's vaccination so that people who have already gotten vaccinated have a very high possibility of not getting sick. If you do get sick with the flu, it's very important to stay at home and minimize contact with others. According to the CDC, the flu is most contagious in the first three to four days of contracting the virus. There is no cure for influenza. However, if you get in to see your physician within 48 hours of your symptoms or 48 hours of exposure, you can receive prescriptions for medications that can lessen the severity. There's still time to get a flu shot. The Superior Walk-In Center offers vaccinations as do most doctor's offices and pharmacies. The flu shot is free with most insurance providers. Reporting in studio, I'm Corinne Griffith, Local 3 News.